Hello and welcome to Red Live. So DJ Zintle's highly anticipated reality show, DJ Zintle Unexpected, premiered on BET Africa and fans were definitely in for a treat. Now Africa's number one female DJ gave fans access to her private life, something that she was very skeptical about doing in the beginning, according to the reports. Now just before the premiere, DJ Zintla posted the following picture and captioned it, it's almost time. We are just a few hours away from the first episode of The Unexpected on BET Africa. This is a special moment for us. Please grab the bottle of Boulevard Rose snacks and whatever it is that you're going to need. At 19.30, let's watch this one together. Now, if you did watch the episode, do get in the comment section down below and let me know what did you guys think about it. I did see on social media it was actually trending throughout the weekend, so I'm assuming that a lot of people did enjoy it. But what we're talking about in this particular video is when her ex-lover and baby daddy aka lost the love of his life, DJ Zintle seemed to get dragged into all of that. Now trolls did come through on social media to say some of the meanest things to Zintle who tried by all means to mind her own business. Now it did get awkward during Anele's memorial service as aka's tribute video mistakenly had a picture of DJ Zintle in the slides. Now DJ Zintle has never really addressed this and she has reserved her silence on social media but on the premiere of her reality show this became a topic of discussion and we finally got to know what DJ Zintle felt about this. Now speaking to her friend and auntie to her two daughters Muesli she got emotional when she discussed all the things social media users were saying about her instead of paying tribute to the young woman who lost her life. DJ Zintle's main concern was being involved in something that she had nothing to do with but also sympathized with both Keenan's and Anele's families. She said the following, this is something that is happening in Keenan's life but because Keenan and I have a child together it ends up affecting me. Keenan has lost someone he loves and now people are making it about me. Now her friend Muesli reckons that it is because that they were an item and have a baby together and said that there is nothing that AKA does that will not sway the spotlight towards DJ Zintle. This is what Muesli said, Keenan can't do anything without you being involved. So those were Muesli's words in, you know, an effort in trying to consult DJ Zintle. Now do keep in mind that this is a pre-recorded reality show and apparently the conversation that they had actually took place a few months ago right after Anelis' death. But yeah, DJ Zintle felt that the attention was unnecessary because the Dembe and the Forbes family were going through worse and her getting involved was even tougher for her. This is what she says, in my view right now there are people that are going through worse with the situation but it's just also a bit tough when the comments are so cruel. But moving right along, DJ Zintle continued to say, the thing about my life is a lot of things happen on social media and they've got nothing to do with me most of the time. They just end up affecting me in some way and I've learned not to care about it. But this is also an emotional time in my life as I'm pregnant. Now in the clip you can actually see that DJ Zintle was very pregnant at the time and I suppose if you believe that women do get emotional while they're pregnant, eh. Now apart from the memorial service slide, DJ Zintle also got dragged into Anele's case after it got reopened. The Western Cape Police together with the National Prosecuting Authority, the NPA had an inquest into her death. At first AKA was investigated as a prime suspect but the case later got seen as a suicide incident. Anele Tembe lost her life on April the 12th, 2021 after allegedly falling off from the 10th floor of a hotel in Cape Town. Now, according to various reports, she was apparently alive for 30 minutes before the ambulance declared her deceased. It is also reported by Sunday World that her phone, which had intricate information relating to her death, had been formatted. The reports claim that in the phone, there were actually comments made by Anele towards DJ Zintle on social media. Now the third time DJ Zintle's name got mentioned regarding Anneli's death was when AKA had an interview. Now in the interview which was meant to address the many speculations regarding the incident AKA mentioned that investigation officers flew all the way to Zintle's home to question her about the case. Apparently the investigating officers wanted to find out from DJ Zintle whether AKA had ever been abusive towards her. But yeah like I said DJ Zintle has finally addressed all of that. And if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to share it with your family, your friends and your enemies. Confuse the hell out of everybody. And as always, thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to Real Live if you haven't and binge watch my previous videos.